So the game made me sell a fish so I could understand the mechanics of selling a fish, which was not hard to understand. It was a big button that said sell. Even I can handle that one, and I'm not very good at these things. Good morning, everyone. Dave from the Wee Hours here today checking out Aquarist, where I'm like 83% sure that we're setting up an aquarium of some sort. It's a simulator kind of thing. I think we're going to wander around and probably have to clean things up before we even get started. But after that, nothing but fish. And we have a brand new winner for creepiest opening to a game ever, and that includes any horror game I've ever seen. This man has burst into a 14-year-old's bedroom first thing in the morning giving me $600, a giant tank of water, and boasting about how strong he is. Okay, I think Dad's gone now. That was... That was weird. That was... That was not okay. I'm, I'm 14 years old. That was just not right. Press Q to see what kind of water I've got. It's very, very important to put the correct type of fish, plants, and decorations in the water, or they'll die. Okay, so starfish and plant bad. Starfish and starfish... Good. That couldn't fit Dave's Awesome Aquarium in here, so it's Dave's Awesome Fish, and so help me God, it's in metric. 150 L's. I don't know what that is. Is that like a mile? That's probably like a mile. The temperature is 14 degrees C, which I am led to believe is actually a comfortable temperature, but seems very warm for those of us who do Fahrenheit, and the water pH is 7. I'm going to be brutally honest. I don't have the slightest idea what pH is. I mean, I've heard it. I know it exists. I know it's a thing that happens. I just have no idea what pH is, but it's very important to some people. So buy a shovel and some soil. Well, good thing Strong Dad brought in 600 bucks for this. Well, there's a shovel right there. Okay, so buy it's only 13 bucks for a shovel. Well, that's easy. And some soil. Uh, that's salt. Probably don't put that in the water. pH minus. Okay, good. So if my pH is plus... I can, I can, I can minus it. Uh, soil? How about, is this soil? Yeah, I want to change subcategories to soil. Soil bag and soil bag. Well, this looks prettier. Wait, is 55 bucks for a bag of dirt? Are you serious? Pick up the new soil and shovel. Where? Where exactly do we, is that, oh. Did dad bring that in? Because that's like extra creepy factor now. Did he just ninja his way in here? And put that over there. I, I I, think I want to talk to somebody who has a degree of authority in this town. Okay, start applying soil. Gotcha. Okay, so do I do that with the shovel? Oh, I can't change my item now. Well, then how do I put, how do I put soil in here? Click, oh, click on the bag. Oh, it's right there in front of me. I gotcha. Okay, I see what we're doing here now. Um, can we, can we put that in there? Oh, there we go. Okay, all right, all right, we're getting there. This is, um, it's gonna take a little while. Can I also just say that my room is remarkably clean for a 14-year-old boy? I've been a 14-year-old boy. My room did not look like this, and I didn't have nearly as many math implements on my desk. I gotta buy a rock. I want, I guess I can only buy that rock. Rocks are one of the most natural decorations that can be placed in an aquarium. They make the aquarium look beautiful, but also affect the ecosystem. Yeah, probably trying not to not to kill our fish. Can I make it bigger? Oh, I can. I want the biggest rock you've got. I'm on the phone to the rock company, the rock store, where the rocks live, and people sell rocks. I'm like, dude, give me the biggest rock. Can I not buy this rock? I want to buy this rock. I want the biggest rock you've got. I just bought like 20 rocks. Yeah, I was just clicking this because I thought I wasn't getting a rock, and then I noticed I've got a lot of rocks now. Some big, some small. Um, well, good news for me, I won't have to buy any more rocks. This is fine. This is fine. There's plenty of room for a fish or two in there. I've, I've crammed all the rocks into the aquarium because I bought them. I paid for them. It's not like I'm not going to use them. And then we need to buy a filter. Is, do I have room? For a filter? And I'm, I'm pretty sure I don't got any more room in here, but I'll give it a shot, kid. Uh, sure, give me uh, just one of these this time. Thank you. Just just one of those. And then put the filter... Where's, where's my filter? It's over there. Everything goes over here. I don't know who's delivering this stuff. It makes me very suspect. Um, that? Am I done? Oh, yeah, sure. This is fine. I got plenty of room for fish. Turn the filter on, and we're good. To oh, a heater. Oh, dear. I'm gonna run out of room super quick, aren't I? Okay, one um, one heater, please. Hopefully they're very, very small. Very, very tiny heaters. Put the heater 
In, oh, it's it's rather small. Okay, good. Right, fine. Um, I I don't know where I'm gonna put. Tuck it. I don't know, tuck it over there. Enable the heater. How hot can I get this thing? Thirty five degrees C. Okay, wait. Double it and add thirty. Oh wow, that's really hot. That's like that's that's almost boiling water. I think. Okay, drop it back down to this, because this seems sensible. And buy a thermometer. Hey, game, could we buy everything at once, instead of one at a time? Just for having the conversation about buying everything at once, instead of one at a time. Okay, we're ready to let the fish in. I don't know where, but we're ready. We're ready to put fish in here. <laughs> two goldfish. Uh, sure, absolutely. Uh, one of them. Uh, give, me, give me two of these, please. Only 15 bucks for a goldfish. Okay. Right. Um, don't really know... Don't really know where you're gonna let... Wait, pick the goldfish up. Oh, they're over here in a bag. Okay, uh, sure. Th this can't possibly go horribly wrong, I'm sure. Uh, put a fish in. Yay, fish! And then put the other friend fish in. Here is your friend. I hope you like each other. Also, I hope you really don't need a lot of space. Right-click on a fish to inspect it? You're assuming I can find one. There's one, there's one. I see him. I, I No, I almost had him. I almost had him. Uh, that... That guy, that guy, no, 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 no. There he is, I got one, I got one. Condition of the fish is shown by its parameters. If the fish is satisfied, it will grow and give birth to offspring. It's a good way to earn money. Oh, we're getting into the underground fish market. Excellent. So it's hungry. The temperature it doesn't seem to care about. Do you want, do you want more temperature? Do you want it warmer? You'd love some plants. I'd love some plants too. I have nowhere to put them, dude. It's just not gonna happen, all right? It's just a bunch of rocks. However, you're pretty satisfied with the bunch of rocks, and you're satisfied with your pH. If you if you can, Fish, could you explain to me what pH is? Because I'm pretty certain I have no idea. Okay, apparently my fish hates everything now. Absolutely everything. It's in critical condition. It. I've owned the fish for like 10 seconds. I named the fish. Maybe we should deal with feeding the fish first. I'm just saying maybe we should feed the fish be before we, be before we, before we name the fish? No, we've got to, we've got to name the fish. Well, I've named my fish I'm Doomed because the fish is going to die at any moment. We need to take care of our fish. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. I think I need to, I think I need to raise the temperature a little bit too. No, that's the thermometer. That's the one that's telling me. Wait, this is the thermometer. Was the other one the heater? I'm, I'm a little fuzzy on that one. Was this one? I thought this was, the, this is the heater. Okay, bump the temperature up a little bit. I think the fish are a little chilly. And then see if we can find some food for these guys. So, what is this? Miscellaneous and food. Freshwater herbivores. Is, is that what a goldfish is? I mean, it's got a picture of a goldfish. It was actually more expensive for the food than it was for the fish. This seems like a losing proposition. Okay, so it cost me more money to buy food for the fish than it does to actually buy the fish. Surely, surely it would be better just to let the fish die and get a new one. That's more economically viable. Okay, food for the fish. There you go. Food for the fish. Uh, drop that. Make that go away. Is there... Okay, I've, I've thrown all my stuff on the ground here. Make the parameters correct. Yeah, I mean, I fed them. What, what else are you really looking for? I don't even know where they are. I've got a tank full of rocks. There's one in there somewhere. Okay, hunger level good. Everything else awful. So I gotta get that temperature up a little bit more, and then, like, another fish wouldn't hurt. Okay, uh, go back to the temperature idea. So, let's get this up, I don't know, like, 24. I've, I've just boiled my fish, haven't I? Alright, let's get one of these at $22 for a plant, and one, 19 for this one. It seems to me just buying lots and lots of fish is the smartest way to play this. The fish are the cheapest things of all here. Okay, um, well, put these guys in here for a start. They're probably, yeah, the plants are over here. I bought extra fish food because I figure I'm going to be going through a lot of these. So let's put you right there. I I don't know where. That, it's down there somewhere. Okay, it's in there. That's fine. That That's fine. And then this one could go on the other side over, like, I don't know, here? There we go. How does that look? can't i don't even know where it is oh all the rocks are falling down now my fish are ready to breed you see i bred a fish yes yeah, see this is the more economically sensible way to play the game just keep making more fish forget about buying them anything just make more of them um you come here 
Okay, hunger good, temperature a little bit on the extreme range, but you're broadly happy with that. A little bit extreme. You're warm. You're like, wow, I could um, I could do with it being a little cooler in here, but, but it's all right. It's okay. Decoration's good. We have a, a nominal amount of fish, and whatever pH is, it's awesome. So the game made me sell a fish so I could understand the mechanics of selling a fish, which was not hard to understand. It was a big button that said sell. Even I can handle that one, and I'm not very good at these things. And I got 12 bucks. So 12 bucks to sell a fish, 15 bucks to buy one. So if I've got two breeding fish and some time, I can make this little tank extremely profitable. I could earn enough money to move out of this creepy house and get away from dad. A background, you say. Okay, uh, well, let's go with the only one that has a picture on it. 45 bucks? Do you know how many goldfish I'm going to have to sell for that? About four. Well, I did indeed buy a background like the game said. I'm just not sure what I've done with it. Do I, do I sort of apply it here? Do I come into Q and then apply this in some way? No, I don't immediately. Oh, we got another fish. Oh, yeah, sell that guy right there. Oh, it's down here. I thought this was a rug. Okay, uh, pop that on there. Well, yeah, now it's all covered, though. Now I gotta go around to this side. I gotta squeeze myself in between my whiteboard here and this to see my background. It's nice, if not spectacular. Game, stop making me buy things. This is a terrible idea. I've only got, like, 75 bucks left. Uh, put this one... No, I wanna put it... I wanna put it here so it doesn't obstruct my view. There we go. Okay, are we done now? Pick up some decorations and put it on the background. Do what now? Pick up some decoration. Okay, put it on the background? I don't think I did that right. I also may have crushed a fish. Alright, so if I zoom in and out, it'll be placed on the background. Uh, that looks odd. But hey, you know what? It's not a big pile of rocks anymore. Okay, this is fine. Buy a scraper and remove unwanted background. Now I'm fine with the background game. I'm totally fine with this. It's a totally acceptable background. Alright, well, let's scrape it off. There we go. Oh, I lost my rock, too. Pick up a lamp. Okay, drop the scraper. Now this is starting to look like a 14-year-old's bedroom. So enable the lamp, and what have I got here? How about red? Yeah, let's do red light there. Okay, it's not a very powerful red light. Maybe it's better when I... Can I turn my own lights off? Do I have a light switch? I don't... I don't have a light switch. There's no light switch in this room. How do I... Where's my light? I have a light over there. How do I turn my light on and off? Forget the fish thing. I mean, I just put the fish thing aside. I'm more concerned with the dynamics of this house. How do I... I can't turn my lights on and off. Is Dad in charge of that? Does he have his own master control light switch? Is he telling me when it's dark and when it's not? This house is messed up, and I need to speak to somebody in social services. All right, let's crank this up. All right, bright red light going down here. Remove decorations. All right, choose a deck. Well, I'll choose one of my many rocks for a start and put it in my trash can. Okay, bye. There you go. One, one rock in the trash can there. Time to see our aquarium up close. Switch to free movement. It looks like aquarium hell in here. Yeah, I'm going to tell you, I do not want to be a fish in this aquarium. Especially because i got to stare at this kid all day. And then Dad might pop in at any moment and boast about how strong he is. Oh, God, Dad's back. Dad's back. Jeez, man. Just came out of nowhere. Your first aquarium is ready. Time to face the real challenge. I have problems with my living room aquarium. This man is wrong. Will you take care of it? And you're going to give me some more money. I... I, I want to run. Okay, if I can get to the living room, I can probably get to the front door. And if I can get to the front door, I can get out. I can alert someone, a neighbor... A, a cop, a crossing guard. I, don't, I, I need to alert someone to what's going on around here. Oh god, it's dark down here too. Can I get out? Can I get out? No, he's locked it. Of course he has. He's in charge of the lights. Why wouldn't he be in charge of the door? I see you've got a light switch. You get a light switch down here. Where is he? Where is he? What is he watching? Music place. Okay. So he's got some like music playing while we're doing this. The table is set for six. There's only two people in this house. 
I, I, I'm not getting out of here alive. Can I grab a knife? No, he'll notice if I grab a knife. Who are you? Are you, are you mom or are you my sister or are you here of your own free will? His tank is just dead fish. This man's fish tank is just dead fish. And he's, he's been enjoying this. He's been sitting down here in the living room going, yep, that's my tank of dead fish. Are you okay? Blink twice if you've been kidnapped. No, 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 no problem, Dad. I'm just going to get get all your dead fish out of here and put them over in the trash. That, that's that's where they are now. If if you need them, if you need them later, I I feel you do. Get a get a scraper. Pick up a sponge. Okay, which the sponge right there. Twenty nine bucks for a sponge. Okay, um. Get the sponge. Look, just don't draw attention to yourself. Just get the sponge and clean the thing. Okay, clean the filter. Don't make any sudden movements or loud noises. Just act normal. Just clean the filter. Everything is fine now. Everything is fine. Okay, I'm just gonna put the filter back in in the aquarium. That in 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 the in the aquarium. No, no, no problem, Dad. No, 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 I, I got it. It's clean. Well, Dad is waiting for me to buy and pick up a bucket, but I've been a little stumped in that the bucket doesn't exist. So everything is locked. There's no there's no bucket in here of any sort. Every single thing is locked in this menu. There is, in fact, no bucket to buy, and there's nothing else that I can click on. Everything is grayed out there. So I'm not, I'm not really sure how to proceed, Dad. And I'm very sorry that I've disappointed you. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna slowly back up. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm sorry. It's every man for himself. Okay, I've got to look out for number one here. I'm gonna very slowly back away and go back up to my room and try and find an escape route. But that's where we'll have to call it a day on this real quick look at Ackworst in the creepiest house I've ever been in in my life. All of this just for some fish. Guys, do please let me know what you thought of Aquarist in the comments down below. And hey, if you enjoyed the video, do please leave a like down below. It does cheer me up no end when people do that. And if you're new to the channel, maybe just checking it out for the first time, feel free to hit that subscribe button. See more of this ridiculous nonsense. Until then, I'm Dave. Thank you, as always, for joining me in the wee hours, and we'll see you next time. You know, an argument could have been made that spending an obscene amount of money on researching the theater just so I can get a sign that says Electric Boogie Lou may not have been my smartest move. That is a strong argument, and that's an argument that you'd probably win, frankly. Wow, naked guy sticks his hand in a beehive. This, this can't end well. I don't know where I would see a leather carpet, but I'm going to imagine I have to pay an entry fee to see it. I have a cylinder. <laughs> I, I broke Dave. You broke Dave. <laughs> Talk about yourselves on the back. <laughs> I just dropped my controller. <laughs> oh my goodness.